Listening nine point one. Hi, Joe. How are you? Oh, hello, Kate. I'm fine, thanks. But how are you? I heard what happened. I'm really sorry. Yeah, Sam and I split up. It's so sad. I know that it was probably for the best, but now I feel so lonely. I often think I felt better when I was with him. Maybe I was wrong to end it. I know it's not easy. When I split up with Mike, I used to think the same. I was really depressed. So what did you do? I couldn't stand always going over the same old thoughts in my mind, so I decided to talk to someone. A friend recommended going to see a philosophy counselor. Well, I don't really want to go to a psychologist. Oh no! Don't worry. A philosophy counselor isn't like a psychologist. They just help you to think about things in a different way. Talking with someone outside the situation really helped me put things in perspective. But how can they solve problems like this just by talking? Well, of course, it's not that simple. Sometimes the problems we have depend on how we see ourselves and our life. Talking things over means you can see things from another point of view. So, what sort of things did you talk about? It sounds a bit serious, but we talked about different philosophers' ideas of love and compared them to my situation. Plato's thoughts on love, for example, were interesting for me. Plato? I don't know anything about Plato or philosophy. You don't need to know anything about philosophy or Plato when you talk to a philosophical counselor. Just like you don't need to understand the words of a song to enjoy the music. His office is in town. I went there for four sessions. Each one lasted about an hour. Was it expensive? Well, it wasn't cheap. I paid eighty euros an hour, but it was definitely worth it.